in algebra and partly in calculus too, you have a lot of procedures which you apply somewhat mechanically in order to solve the problems. But in geometry, you really have to think about proof. And so uh, that's why I like geometry uh, very much. And when I was at uh, Princeton and was trying to uh, think of a thesis topic, it occurred to me that there was a question that I hadn't seen uh, uh, addressed before, namely comparing geometry, elementary geometry, uh, where the basis for geometry are flat subspaces like points, lines, planes, etc., for higher dimensions. And so after I thought about it, I realized that many incidence theorems are true at all dimensions. And that's what became my thesis, that there is just one infinite dimensional geometry. <clears throat> that is to say, uh, uh, as Tarski proved completeness of the geometric axioms, and that in particular means that the theory is complete. Every theorem formulated with the primitives is either provable or disprovable. Uh, so it's a complete theory. <clears throat> so it turns out that the sequence of complete theories with different dimensions converges. There's only one infinite dimensional theory. That's those are the theorems that are eventually true mm. from some point on. Right. And so that was what I established in my uh, thesis. My church didn't have anything to do with the development of the mathematics there, but he very kindly corrected the spelling in my thesis. Uh, I can uh, credit him for helping me in the presentation there. Of course, our church was very uh, much concerned with uh, presentation and editing and those kind of things. And so those were valuable, uh, valuable lessons uh, from him, but he didn't really take part in the uh, uh, understanding of the geometry there, but he was happy to accept it as a thesis topic. <clears throat>